How clever do you have to be to put yourself in someone else's shoes? And what's the advantage? From the time humans are two years old, we start to show empathy and understanding of what another person might be feeling. For a long time, scientists thought that this was a uniquely human trait. But lately, they've discovered that certain animals could be much better at reading and reacting to the emotional states of others than we previously thought. Prairie voles, which live in bonded pairs, will go to great lengths to groom and nurture a mate that's showing signs of stress. This isn't proof of empathy on its own, but scientists have shown that this behaviour is triggered by the same hormone, oxytocin, that's associated with feelings of empathy in humans, which suggests a common mechanism for these feelings of caring. The case has been made for empathy amongst just a few select species, including dolphins primates and dogs. But the most moving example comes from the largest land animal on Earth, the elephant. Elephants have complex societies, with group sizes ranging from dozens to around 100 individuals each one of whom can live for up to 70 years. Long lives and close bonds means that a death, particularly that of a matriarch, is a traumatic event. And elephants have recently been observed visiting and caressing the bones of their departed friends. This expression of elephant grief makes a strong case for some animals at least being capable of complex emotions like empathy.